everyone. I'm Katie from The Op, and this is the How to Play video for Hues and Cues, our new party game that challenges your ability to make colorful connections with words. This game is for three to 10 players, ages eight plus, has a play time of about 30 minutes, and costs $24.99. So first, all players are gonna pick a color and pick up their three corresponding cones. Two of those cones are gonna be what you use to make your guess, and the other cone is gonna go directly on the board just left of the scoring track. Each round, someone gets to be the cue master, and whoever is wearing the most colorful outfit gets to go first. When you're the cue master, you pick up a card from the deck that reveals four different colors that match the board. Your goal is to get the other players to guess which square you're talking about by giving them cues. Now there are some rules as the cue master. First, you cannot use a clue that indicates any sort of direction on the board, right, left, up, or down. You also cannot say any of the major rainbow colors, no red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, or pink, but any variation of those colors is allowed. So for example, if this was my card and I was the first cue master, I would pick B19. My first cue to the players at the board is gonna be one word. So it could be magenta. All players in clockwise order, are they gonna place their first cone wherever on the board they think I'm talking about. Only one player can be on each square. After all players have made their guess, the cue master now gets to give a two or one word clue that describes the same color. So for example, I would do dragon fruit as my second cue. Now every player gets to make their second guess. Now this is important. Play goes counterclockwise this time. After all players have made their second guess, the cue master is gonna take the scoring square and put it directly over the correct square. And now you're gonna assign points based on how close your guesses were. If someone gets it exactly right, they get three points for that cone. If you guess within the square, you're gonna get two points per cone. And if you guessed along the outside rim of the square, you get one point per cone. And then you just move your third cone, which is sitting on the scoring rack, appropriately. Gameplay continues until each person has had the chance to be the cue master. After that, whoever has the highest points wins. I'm Katie from The Op, and this has been the How to Play video for Hues and Cues. Thanks for playing.